Hello friends and fellow gamers, I hope you've all been enjoying the sun. I am wearing a special, special summer shirt, because I, well, it's the summer. It's been hot, and I hate the heat. But um, that's not what I've come to talk to you guys about today. There's something a little more important, let's say. It is the end of an era, as the title of this video suggests. This is my main account. Many of you will be familiar with it. It's level 323, it's VIP 10, I've spent a lot of time and a lot of money on this account. And if you don't know quite how things work here on this channel, things got a little difficult for me around um, the start of this year. We started the free-to-play series almost a year ago now, and as I was approaching 2021, my work-life balance was getting quite hard. I was unable to keep going with my other accounts and also with my main account. So a friend of the stream, Tartarus, helped me. He basically said he'd look after my main account, he'd help push the void, and he'd help me make the progress that I was struggling to make. The void was something I just didn't have the time to commit to, because there was so much other stuff I was doing. Editing videos, trying to maintain relationships with my family, and also, most importantly, obviously just streaming and looking after the free-to-play series. So, what do I do now? Well... I've mostly just focused on the VIP series, and Tartarus has looked after the main account for these last, almost, let's say, six months now. It's been crazy. It's been a long, long time. Half a year of doing this, and it's been great. But Tartarus is moving on with his life. He wants to play a little bit less idle heroes and focus on more important things, most likely school and other things that are going to be more valuable to him as an individual. So for me, I'm going to lose probably one of the most fantastic people that I've met during my time as an Idle Heroes content creator. I have always said since I started this that the community is the biggest thing that pushed me to keep making content for this game. After all, there's loads of games I could play. Minecraft, Rocket League, CS... No, not CSGO, that's a lie. I mean, I've always joked about trying Valorant. It looks like a really cool game. But nope, I always keep coming back to Idle Heroes because at the end of the day, Idle Heroes is first of all the game I'm known for and also a game I just really enjoy playing. I love going back and starting accounts again. And I love helping people who are starting their accounts too. Now that's the problem. My enjoyment in this game comes from grinding out in the certain areas. And this account has been through many eras. This account was made when E3, well, just enables full stop weren't a thing. 10 star was the highest you could take a hero to. Faithblade was the most powerful hero. Look at it now. So many E5s, so many imprints, two Transcendence heroes. It's wild. And I just... Honestly, most things are cleared. Seal Land, apart from Abyss, is all done. We're going to be building Waldeck when he's released in Profit Orbs. That's the only thing, really, that I've got left to do in this account. Tower of Oblivion is cleared, we're waiting for this new game mode to come out, the Dreamland, that's going to be fun, yes, we'll try it out on here, but besides that, is that fun for me? No, not really. CCL has gone, This uh, basically this server has long surpassed Season 10, there is no more Crystal Crown League, and sure, they're bringing out a new 6v6 game mode, but it's not here yet, and this account therefore has lost a lot of the motivation for me. Take a look here, here's my guild, and yeah, we just keep ticking over with the guild settlement. We'll go do our settlement quest, we'll go send things in. It doesn't really matter, we'll just pop in our assassins, look at that, so great, start, boom. It's nice, let's get this as high as we can. Is there a need to, though? Yeah, sure, it's fun, it's a grind, you get more guild coins, and yes, you can go spend them in the guild tech. And boom, let's just go ahead and attack in the guild war, I might as well. But these are all things I have to do day in, day out, that I should also be doing on the VIP series. And for me, the VIP series is where my money is going, it's where my energy is going, and it's obviously the thing I care about way more than this main account. So it's looking like very soon, if Tartarus isn't going to be here to help me, and if I can't find someone else who can look after this account... It may be the end of my first ever Idle Heroes account. And lots of you might be going crazy, going, Oh, MK, give the account away. But if you look, all of my accounts, all of them are linked to this email. Because I never wanted to be in a situation where I had to just switch emails and switch passwords. Too messy. I like the idea that everything is linked to the same email address. But the one problem, therefore, is I can't get rid of the account. It's going to stay here. And that's good. I can revisit it. But I don't know how committed I can be to constantly looking after this. 
it's a lot of time and a lot of effort to go through all these different game modes, to keep up with the content, to stay relevant in the different game modes. And honestly, guys, it costs a lot of money to do that as well, to keep getting artifacts, to go through time and time again with events and spend to stay up to date with people that have void imprints that I don't, right? I don't have a full void four team. I don't have a full transcendence team. I'm trying, but I'm not there. So what is a man to do? Well, as you can see, I can click through and do my dailies and that's absolutely fine. We can claim things, we can quick dispatch, we can just do it all normal. But the one thing I can't do anymore, well, I don't know if I can spend money on this account and also do the VIP series. And that puts me in a situation where I have to choose between the two. And the account that gives me the most joy and the account I like playing the most and the account honestly that I think you guys want to see more of is the VIP series. Starting the game again, facing the new challenges, enjoying it, it's all good. Just think of a big game that you've played, maybe like Skyrim or Red Dead Redemption, something like that. You know when you complete the game, you don't just keep playing for the sake of it. You don't just wander around in a world you've cleared with your overpowered character. Sure, it's fun at times, but you don't play the game anywhere near as much. There's no story mode, there's no motivation. It's all disappeared. That's kind of how I feel with this account. I have no motivation to keep going. So for me, honestly, I may just stop. I may end this account and just focus on the VIP series and allow my motivation that comes from playing the VIP series to filter over into this account. To be something that I actually use to drive my content. Because obviously it's so much more fun to make content you enjoy. And sure, we'll revisit this account. Don't worry, there will be times we come back and we'll do things like core openings or we'll do it for summons. But I don't think this is going to be an account you're going to see too much of in the future. Yes, we need to go do wall deck. Yes, we need to go see the new Dreamland game mode when it's out. But apart from these normal end game things that we'll take a look at when they get released, I don't know how much I'm actually going to play on this account as my main focus. Because honestly, there's no reason to. There's no pleasure. And I've said this before in my talking videos, that actually going around and doing things in these different game modes, it can be fun, sure, it can be great, it can be very fulfilling, it can be really fulfilling. But not anymore. Not on this account. Heck, a little bit of me just wants to smash this area. You know what? I think I will. Yes, I could go visit this mine, but why? So I can get slightly more resources? Sure, it's a great idea. But I don't really want to be using this account too much. I don't care if this account stays relevant and with the other stuff. There's so much more I can focus on in the VIP series. So much more progress that can be made there. That all these little things I'm doing right now, they don't even matter to me. I don't mind. I'm not motivated. And that's fine. So if you guys ever find yourself in a similar situation where you're running multiple accounts all at the same time. And you don't know what to do with them. Then it's fine. You can leave it. And sure, Tartarus has been a great help. I know there's loads of people out there in the community that at some point or another get to a stage in their life where they go, I cannot keep up with all my accounts. Therefore, I need to stop. Look at Sol. Sol was a really active member of our community and he had to take a break and he has spent tens of thousands of dollars on this game. And his dad used to have multiple accounts he looked after. Sol's dad now just runs one account. And that's fine. Sometimes we need to make that decision that we just can't juggle the stuff we used to be able to. For me, the VIP series is the most important. It is my main focus. And therefore, I don't want to let this account get in the way of what I think is the best content this channel's ever produced. And that's fine. So folks, what I'll be doing is when Waldeck is released in Profit Orbs, I will be building Waldeck on this account. We're going to go to the Seal Lands. We're going to try and clear it. That I can promise you. But before we leave this account behind with that video, whenever that comes out, whenever that is, probably in a couple months time, what I can do for you is I have 40 cores of transcendence. So we're going to go into the void and we're going to finish things up here in the compass of transcendent. We're going to go in fate and we're going to see just what we can get. Now, for those of you that don't know, I am very, very lucky when it comes to fate. I get many, many transcending spheres. So let's see how many I can get today. We'll do our M for good luck. Let's try and get lucky. There's one Transcending Sphere. Fantastic. Great start. So that's us uh, 
One sphere and a ten bomb. That's good. Let's go again. Let's see what else we can pull. Nothing in that one. I'm going to quit. I want to go back in. That's kind of how I like to do it. I feel like that gives me better luck. Okay, there's another sphere. There's a Rogan. So right now, we've done 30. We've got two spheres. That's exactly what you'd expect from Guidance. And we have one more ten bomb to do. Can we get super lucky? Doesn't matter if we don't. No, we didn't. It seems even my sphere luck has ran out on this account. That's a shame. Folks, let me know in the comment section what you want me to do with this account. Let me know what you want to see. I'm not sure I can keep it ticking over. Maybe I will be able to. Who knows? Maybe I'll find someone that wants to help look after this account that I trust with my email address and password. But that's unlikely. It's going to take a very special someone that I can trust that kind of authority to. Tots Horus was one of my moderators. Talking Scribe looks after my Angel Legion account when I'm, you know, not um, not able to look after it myself. So I do have people in there helping. But I don't know if I'll find someone else for this. If you've got any ideas in the comment section, any stuff you want to see me do to this, apart from destroy it, I'm not going to Wrath of Gods this account. That would just be stupid. But, um, yeah. I think I'm going to turn it into a testing account where we just test stuff out. Because I have a lot of artifacts on here, especially when they switch out Magic Stone Sword, I can pick something up. And we can just try and use this as a platform to really just try out new heroes and see how they perform. Because I have a very, very good PvP core. It would be nice to pick up Asmodel and then kind of have like a little more to work with. Um, how are we actually doing for um, the old Transcender Thingamabobbies? Let's go have a look. How are we doing? What was that? It was uh, I'm only halfway there. Yeah, I suppose that's just kind of what we're going to have to accept then. But hey, you know, it's been fun. It's been a fun journey. It's been three years and three months on this account. A long time. Nearly three years and four months, actually. That's that's wild. So three and a third years. Crazy. But like all good things, guys, I think it's time to close the door on this account and move on to better things. Better things like the VIP series. And um, yeah, without Tartarus's help, I don't think I can maintain this account. And that's fine. It really is. So folks, that's all from me today. I just wanted to kind of put this announcement out there that it is going to be the end of an era. That this account is over and done with. At least for the most part. I don't know if I'm going to be logging in daily. I don't know if I'm going to be looking after things. And I think the one thing that's going to really suffer is the guild. I will probably have to leave a guild and maybe start my own or find a guild that will just take me if I'm not logging in that frequently. But that's unlikely. I wouldn't want any guild to have to suffer an account that maybe logs in only three times a week. So that's probably not going to be what I do. But either way, I'm kind of accepting that this is probably something pretty crazy for a lot of you out there. I, I think this account we've spent over 8000 maybe even $10,000 on. That's a lot of money. But sometimes you have to move on. So folks, that's all from me today. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below, and I hope to hear from you, and I hope you have some maybe positive or maybe even distraught things to say. I don't know, I think it'll be pretty funny. But either way, guys, put your thoughts below, and I'll see you next time. Happy idling.